behaving the way that they are. Hey guys, my name is Jonathan and I'm a staff here in YWAM Antipolo. I'm 26 years old and I'm from Australia. These past four weeks, I've been a part of a group where we have been facilitating uh, training for preaching and public speaking. And so today I want to share the importance of communication. So the importance of public speaking, or better yet, communication, is that we're able to communicate different things such as values, or beliefs, or ideas, or even maybe more biblical, it's wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. And so for the past four weeks, me as a facilitator and my friend have been helping this group of participants to hone their skills to be able to preach with clarity and with power. So as we've been experiencing with our participants, we've seen a lot of different breakthroughs for them. They've been gaining skills and been growing in the way that they are pronouncing their words. We've been having a lot of fun with tongue twisters. They've been giving 15 minute and 30 minute preachings every week and this has helped them to break through their own personal boundaries and their own shyness and this has given them the courage and the confidence to speak out what God has put on their hearts. We've been given a great commission from God and so in Matthew 28 verses 18 to 20 it says and, and Jesus came and spake unto them saying all power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you. And lo, he is with us always, even unto the end of the world. So. With this verse, this commission that we have been given, we are training up these participants to be effective communicators of the gospel, of their testimonies, and of the truth that God has put into their hearts and into their minds. We are hoping to send them out into our communities, into our cities, and into the nations here and far away. Can you imagine a world without communication? The government, media, education, sports, all of these things would have problems because there's no communication. They would not be able to function. And so we see that communication is a very important part in our world. We need it to survive. We need it to build up our nations. We need it to build up each and every individual on this earth. That's why communication is important. So thank you for listening to me. Thank you for letting me share what we've been doing here in YWAM Antipolo. And I pray that you're encouraged and I pray that you're expectant and hoping for more. And that even during this season, in, in the middle of this pandemic, that you are being productive, that you are taking the opportunity to grow and to expand yourself and to be effective so that when we're done with this pandemic we're able to go out we're able to preach the gospel we're able to be effective ministers of what god has given to us in this great commission all right thank you guys for watching thanks for being a part of ywam antipolo this week we hope you've been excited we hope you've been encouraged also and push forth to do greater and bigger things for god uh, we'll see you next week with another video Peace out and God bless.